hi welcome back today I'm coming to you from the beautiful Peak District and I recently bought this camera this is a Canon A1 and I'll take a few pictures here and show you them talk about the camera what I like so yeah let's uh, take a look at what's to discover This is an electronic camera with a built-in meter and it has the same four exposure modes that you'll find on modern digital cameras with a PSM dial. So it's got a manual mode where you set the aperture and the shutter speed yourself. It's got shutter speed and aperture priority modes where you set one and the camera drives the other. And it has a fully automatic mode where you only need to focus and the camera sets aperture and shutter speed itself. You set the ISO value of your film and also the exposure compensation if you want to over or underexpose your film um, on a style on the left here. And then on the right you have another dial and it's in combination with the um, aperture dial, uh, the aperture ring on the lens, you set whichever mode you want. It is a little bit confusing, it's not as straightforward as having one dial with P, A, S and M, but it has all four modes. Um, and it also has a self-timer function at two or ten seconds which is really cool and useful to uh, take selfies. And that's all, pretty much all there is to this camera. There are a few more additional buttons, but they don't really do that much. And um, yeah, let me show you some more pictures I've taken with it. <laughs> okay, that was a nice day of shooting and I've used up all the film that's in this, this, this entire roll. So I want to show you how to get it out. Um, so if you see this button here, in the bottom of the camera, you press that. It takes a little bit of force. And then you flip out this little crank on the ISO dial. And there's an arrow that points in the direction you have to turn it clockwise. And then you just turn that and you'll see on the frame counter here, you'll see that it starts to count down because you're um, basically doing the same thing in reverse that you're doing when you're shooting and advancing the film. So I'm just going through all the frames and eventually you'll Feel the resistance go and this will be at S, the dial, 
and you also hear it flap and then you can open up the camera by pulling this out and then it'll move um, a little bit about a centimeter and then you feel some pressure and then you pull it just a bit further and this springs open and you have the film you can take it out